Let's go. First time was on defense and interception. We get the ball back to the offense, and we take it down to the end zone and score. It's a simple blueprint that is working for the Wagner defense. That's our main focus, too. As, we've, as you've been seeing, we've been on defense about an hour by now. Many times, fans only talk about offense. Of course, that side of the ball scores most of the touchdowns. The Wildcats, though, make sure they talk about defense just as much. We're just trying to, trying to get to the football in a hurry, and we have a saying, we, we'd rather run on Friday nights to the ball than Monday when nobody's watching. The Wildcats sure are running to the ball well. This is really one of the first years that I've not coached uh, turnovers. We're not putting extra emphasis on turnovers. Uh, we're just putting an extra emphasis on alignment and assignment. According to KHSAA stats, the Wildcats lead Class 4A in interceptions with four Team. Elijah Sickles leads the team with five of them. I play quarterback too, so I most of the time know where the ball is going. I'm just there. The stats also show that Wagner has forced 13 fumbles this season, which is third most in Class 4A. Terrence Crawford is credited with five forced fumbles. When we see one person hit him, the main focus is to fly to the football. So we fly to the football, it means he wants 11 men on the ball. And we also hit him at one time, and he caught the ball eventually. Head coach Ty Lawson hopes to see continued success on that side of the ball because he is a believer that defense wins championships. They're really buying into it, and, and they they see the the benefits of it. The main benefit so far is a five and one start. Let's go. Andrew Chernoff, WLKY Sports.